Hello. This is a guide to help you flash the firmware onto a Pure Thermal 1. You will need an ARM MCU JTAG adapter with ribbon cable, as well as a ST-Link version 2. First, flip open the lock on the ZIF socket, then insert the ribbon cable and lock the ZIF socket. Tape can help keep the ribbon inserted in the ZIF socket. Now do the same on the Pure Thermal 1 board. On both the ARM breakout and the Pure Thermal 1, the ribbon cable's contacts will be facing down towards the PCB. Now plug in the large ribbon cable supplied with the ST-Link into the ST-Link. Then plug it into the ARM adapter Use the silk screen on the adapter to correctly orientate the cable. Now plug the USB cable into the ST-Link. Next, plug the other end of the USB cable into your computer. Then plug a micro USB cable into the Pure Thermal 1. Press the on off button. Now we need to download the latest firmware located in the release section of the Pure Thermal 1 GitHub page. Next, extract the archive files. Now launch the STM32 ST-Link utility. Connect the Pure Thermal 1 in the target menu. Next, select the bin file. Now, click the Program Verify button. Make sure to select Reset after programming. Your Pure Thermal 1 has been successfully flashed. Thanks for watching.